definitely been a minute since we, you know, we've spoken face to face like this. You're so comfortable. Yeah, you know, I'd have to agree. It really has been a long time since you and I had a little chit chat. But since we're here, you need something from me, don't you? Yeah, I actually do need to ask you a few questions for the sake of a project, you know, we have to do. Uh, first, though, we should introduce ourselves. Hello, Hello. My, my name, name is, is William, William Hall, Hall, and the, the internet, internet knows, knows me as, as Crickly Crick Bunyan, Bunyan 49. 49. CB49, just for short, and to save face. By we, you mean him, right? Yeah, it's it's him. I'll get right to the point. What exactly are we passionate about? Hmm. Well, a number of we things, just need really. One. We just need one. Fine. Uh, one thing. Well, if I had to think, if I had to choose, it'd probably be streaming and making content. Wait, so just to be clear, Passionate as in all day, every day, all you think about is just different ways to make content for other people to watch? Mm, yeah, that sounds about right. I am a right. You know, fun stuff kind of comes with the territory. You know what, I'm going to ignore that little quip of yours. So, what exactly made us want to start making content in well, the first Well, I mean, the sheer amount of inspiration, of course. I mean, there was Sky Does Minecraft, though he goes by Sky Does Everything now. Um, Captain Sparkles with uh, things like Fallen Kingdom. Um, Jacksepticeye, you know, him being in the woods in his shed with basically no in the middle of nowhere, screaming like a maniac. And then we have, we can't forget, the king of finance and Freddy's himself, Markiplier. Wait, Markiplier as in the drunk Minecraft went wrong alcohol poisoning Markiplier? The very same. So what exactly made him inspire us? Well, I mean, to name a few things, he taught us that you didn't have to just be good at one game to make a successful channel. I mean, he capitalized on the variety creator concept and owned it. A variety creator being, you know, someone who doesn't stay on one game forever. And we basically revere him as, like, the golden role model when it comes to the variety format. I see. So that's why we chose to be a series-based variety streamer slash content creator. Yes, yes, that really is why we chose to be that way, but, you know, that's not really the whole story. It never really is, is it? From a younger age, we always had ideas about whatever, whenever, you name it, it was probably going through our head at the time. So, when we found out that YouTube was a platform where you could just send any idea to at any time, we, we wanted to jump on board, we wanted to get into it. But we really couldn't afford any of the things we were we required had to make. We had nowhere near enough of anything. I mean, that's why we told our dad about what we wanted, and, you know, he said that he'd help us, and he, and he said that he wanted to start a joint channel with us, so we were way ready for it, and we wanted to start with him. But uh, even though he said, start soon over and over, no, we, we never, never did to start. to start that joint channel. Um, so, you know, uh, in 2020, we gave up on waiting and we started our Twitch channel. And to try and get supplies and, you know, equipment for it, we decided to, you know, instead of asking for gifts at our birthdays, Easter, Christmas, we started asking for cash so we could save the money and put it towards things like microphones, a uh, new computer better headphones um, um, and one year later here we are we're still small but you know, we have a foot on the door so what we got here 
how we got here, but for why? Why, what, why are we exactly? Here? Well, why do we keep doing it? Well, on a more serious note, we keep doing it because we made a difference in someone's life. I do remember that. Well, to be brief about the backstory of it, when the channel was tiny and we had maybe one viewer at any given moment, we jumped the gun and made a Discord to reach out to the few people that we had in the community, you know, just kind of, you know, connect with them since it was still small enough that I could do that. What I never expected, though, was one of them reaching out to me personally and um, seeking life advice because they were at the end of their rope in stress and whatever was going on and they felt they needed to talk to someone and they chose me as that person. Of course, we're not going to say their names in the pursuit no, of privacy. Yeah. No, no, never, never. But um, they they told me about what they were going through, and you know, we offered the best advice that we could. Um, they thanked us, told us that when we stream, it helps them forget, even if only for a few moments or minutes at all, about the bad stuff that they were dealing with in their lives, and that it helped you know improve what they were going through. Hearing those words is what really cemented our ambition to make content for other people and not just for myself, you know. I'm not, at that point I realized that, you know, I'm not in it for the fame, I'm not really in it for the money, though, to be fair, money is nice. I won't say no to a few hundred dollars, um, but really, I'm just making the content because if my content is be able, is able to be viewed around the world, then that means that someone somewhere at some time is has a chance to see my content and watch it and their day improves just because you know I'm being me and that and that thought is amazing because you think to yourself, Wow, hold on, wait a minute. Someone from Germany is just like someone from like Germany for instance could reach out to me and be like, hey, I like your content, it's really cool, you know, you really helped me through a rough spot, or I was watching your content in the middle of class, and, you know, when someone does that, I actually, we actually scold them <laughs> vehemently and tell them to go get out of class, and we've actually timed someone out before for um, watching our, my content during class they, that they were saying, and, you know, that's, that's, that's really why we do it. That is, that is yeah. why we do it. That's exactly what I said. That's, that's exactly why we do it.